Ms. Ling Zhong, Professor of Economics at the Chang Kong Graduate School of Business, join us now. Uh, good to see you, Professor Zhong. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thank you for having me. Well, what's the future of telecommuting? Will it become more accepted, in your opinion? Um, I think it's definitely becoming more and more popular that more people are willing to consider it as an option as your videotape has shown. And um, I don't think it would overwhelmingly replace the traditional way of work because like telecommunication just have its advantages and disadvantages. Like you see that it's a very good option for independent workers like graphical designers and uh, editors or, or programmers. And it's also good for teams with very clear communication protocol. But you see, it's not a very good at delivering tricky conversations, such as negotiation, or when uh, a manager is trying to deliver a critical comments to workers. So I would say it's going to replace some of the jobs and uh, make it pure, maybe even purely uh, online, but it's not going to replace all jobs. And Professor Zhang, how much will this new trend affect efficiency and corporate earnings? Because uh, we, we have seen that the habit has set in to some extent, and also the impact on carbon footprint. Um, let me answer these two questions separately. So first on uh, work efficiency, you see that independent workers will have more flexible work style, including hours, location, and work-life balance, that's for sure. And you see that it makes team communication easier. Um, there are a lot of tools, uh, say uh, the uh, facial developed by uh, ByteDance, and um, there are studies have shown that work from home can increase work efficiency and increase work output because uh, workers' efficiency measured by, say, output per uh, uh, same amount of time would increase if they work from home and they also work for longer hours because they have either access to say food, lunch, or whatever they need in their work hours. And on corporate earnings, I think if you're talking about how uh, telecommuting uh, can help firm uh, say cut office space, then definitely yes, it's going to uh, increase firm profit. But you see, there is another channel that is going to affect both efficiency and firm profit. That's where firms can hire people remotely. Mm -hmm. And uh, if they can do that, then the firms have lar a larger pool of potential candidates to choose from, right? Mm -hmm. Then it's going to increase the efficiency in job and worker match. The higher match quality would definitely increase uh, the firm profit and efficiency. And then firm can also pay the worker less by paying at a competing price at the worker's physical location instead of the firm location. So suppose the firm can hire from a small town, a very uh, efficient, uh, say, secretary or, or administrative staff, and this person works remotely, uh, then they can just pay a very competitive price at their uh, their account, not as mega cities like Shanghai. Mm -hmm. 